Hey guys, Daniel 750 here, and today I'm going to be showing you how to jailbreak any iPod Touch or iPhone, except for the iPhone 3GS right now, on a Mac. So here I have my iPhone 3G, so I'm going to show you how to jailbreak it. You need to first be on iPhone 3.0 from iTunes, and next you got to download two files. You have to download a file called Red Snow, which we have right here, and you also have to download the firmware if you do not already have it on your computer. So once you download those two files, and I recommend putting them on the desktop if you want, so they're easier to find, the first thing you're going to do is open up Red Snow. Now this process works on a Mac, but there's also a process that works on the PC, which is very similar. So once you open up Red Snow, you're going to press Browse, and you're going to want to find the iPhone 3.0 firmware that you had to download earlier. So I'm going to select it, and then you're just going to press Open. So now it's going to process the firmware and make sure it's good, so everything's all good. And you're going to press next. So now it's just going to be jailbreaking it, and it's all done. So it's going to ask you, do you want Cydia, which there would be no point not to have Cydia. So you're going to press next. Make sure this install Cydia is checked. You're going to go next. And now it's telling you, make sure your iPhone is turned off and plugged in. So right now, my iPhone is not turned off, but it is plugged in to my iPhone and my computer. So the first thing you're going to do is this is the power button and this is the home button. So anytime I say power, power means the top and home button means the bottom. So you're going to press and hold the power button for a few seconds until you see the slide to unlock. This could take a few seconds. Press and hold. So now you have the slide to uh, turn off, so you're going to slide it. And one is, once it is completely turned off and you don't see no spinny thing on the, on the screen, and it's completely black, so as you can see the spinny thing's on, and now it's completely off. So once you make sure your iPhone is plugged in and completely turned off 100%, you're going to press next. But I'm going to explain. Right before I press next, I'm going to explain what, what you have to do. So the first thing you have to do is press and hold the top button for three seconds and then release, then press this button. So after you press this button for three seconds, you're going to hammer on this button, hold this for 10 seconds. When the 10 seconds is up, you're going to release the top while not releasing the bottom. And you're going to hold the bottom for about 30 seconds. So it's going to give you instructions right on the screen, but I just wanted to explain it just to let you guys know. So first instructions when you press next press and hold the corner top 2 1 now it's going to do the 10 9 8 7 6 5 4 3 2 1 now release the top keep holding the bottom so you're going to have instructions on the screen with timers and everything once the timer is up which will be in a few seconds now it's going to do jailbreaking, waiting for a device to reboot, etc. Now you may see a couple different screens such as the white screen, but this is all normal. Everything's all good. So now it's just going to say waiting for a reboot. So you should get a black screen right now. And if everything went successful, you're going to see this hard drive with an arrow on the top. And it's basically just downloading the jailbreak to the device. And then in a few seconds, it's actually going to jailbreak the device. So this should be up within a couple seconds. So once the bar on the top is done, it's done about right now, it's going to update the kernel, upload the kernel there, and you're going to see random different things flash on the screen, but make sure this iPhone does not unplug any time throughout the device. So right now, the actual uploading the jailbreak to the iPhone is done. So on your screen, it's just going to say finish. So just click finish, and now everything on that jail iPhone is going to do its part. So we're just going to leave this here for a second and I'll come back to the video when it's all done. Now you're going to see a pineapple running with the bar and once this bar is done, you're going to reboot. It's going to reboot automatically. So just leave everything as it is and that's it. Okay, so now your iPhone has been completely jailbroken and successfully jailbroken. So once this has happened, you're going to see the Apple logo as if it's booting up itself. So once it reboots, you should have Cydia right installed right on your home screen. 
So once this is done, I'm going to show you exactly where City is on the home screen. Okay, so now the iPhone has been completely and successfully jailbroken, so I'm just going to slide to unlock to make sure City is on here. So it's not on the home screen right now, but it's far right. And here's City right here. So that's it. That's pretty much simple. If you guys have any questions on how to jailbreak it, just leave me a PM on YouTube. And that's it. So next video, I'm going to show you how to get cracked apps on the iPhone. Thanks for watching. If, if this video helped, please subscribe.